we are back. The scariest part. It's like a welcome back to Manila. Back in the vibes. Things just get better and better. Whoa, it's busy. Whoa. <laughs> Good to be back. I can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> We are back in Manila, back to where our journey first started here in the Philippines just two short months ago. It's always noisy, it's so difficult to find a street that's quiet for us to even talk on. We didn't actually get to do as much as we liked last time, so this time we're gonna hit the ground running. We have been on the island for such a long time and that's why we are so excited to be back in the city life feeling the busy hustle and bustle. We absolutely love Manila and this time we're gonna see more, do more, eat more. It's just gonna be a trip, so let's go. Today our plan is to just go and explore different parts of the city that we haven't been to. Just get a vibe for what Manila has to offer and in the next upcoming videos we're going to be doing some exciting things here. As always please send some recommendations of some things to do while we are here. We're just going to try and cross the street. This is always the adventure. It's like a always the scariest part. It's like a welcome back to Manila and it has just started raining. Oh no! So, Okay, I don't know how we're gonna cross this street. We always look like we have no idea what we're doing. Choose a moment and run. <laughs> okay. Find the gap. Find the gap. <laughs> oh my Whew. gosh. Never get used to that. Oh, what is this? Oh, Shamai. What is this? It's uh, like quick, quick. Oh, okay. This is one of the best parts about being in Manila is you're in the high buildings in the streets and then you can just get some local some local Filipino food. And this is Shao Mai, which is kind of like a dim sum, but like a Filipino version. It's something we have wanted to try for a long time. I couldn't let you have all the fun, could I? <laughs> I needed to try one too. Mm. This is our first time trying Shao Mai, and I don't know why, because we should have been having this the whole time we were here. Kind of like um like a dumpling, and it goes so well with a little vinegar. It's a little bit salty and a little bit spicy. There is a piece of pork inside, and then it is crunchy on the outside. And it's hot, so it's fresh off the cart. <laughs> you can be on the busy streets with the tall buildings but you can still eat some local food right from a cart on a bike. Yeah literally and it's busy. <laughs> Thank you. See you next time. This is a good start to our day. Woo. That shamai was good but now I think I need a coffee and I know in Manila they make really really good coffee so Let's go see what we can find. There's always something super special about being here in Manila. It's like we're back in that energy, back in the vibes. Everybody is super friendly. Everyone greets us on the street and I mean everybody. The hustle and bustle of cars, pedicabs, <laughs> jeepneys, the works. everything. It just, yeah. it just makes you want to go out and explore this beautiful city. It's been a bit strange to just be on remote island for such a long time. And now there are so many people, so many tall buildings. What's interesting for me is how different each area is in Manila. For example, Makati, BGC, Mandaleong where we are right now, and in Passe where we were last time. They are completely different. Also, every place that we've been to, the tricycles are different. And so are the sidecars. No way! Hi! Oh, hi! Thank you for watching! So 
Very nice to meet you. What is your name? Greggy. Greggy. Nice to meet you. Bye. 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 literally recognize us and hopped out of their tricycle to come and see us and take a selfie so I hope they send it to us they were so so sweet oh we always get that kind of reaction from every single person we meet just open friendly want to chat say hi wow that's great. unreal that gives us so much energy oh I've got an energy boost now so speaking of meeting if you're in Manila and you want to meet send us a message on Instagram saying let's meet and then we can talk a little later. So we've just stopped at a cute little coffee shop to have some much needed coffee. And we've stopped at this really cute coffee shop called TGC. And it's really quaint, really quirky. It's exactly what we needed. cute little iced latte and this looks and smells amazing. Five reasons why we're so happy to be back in Manila. Go! The energy. The food. The good coffee. The people. The people has to be like two points. Yeah, the people has Okay, six reasons. <laughs> we are in the Mandalayang area and we're going to take a train now from Bonnie Station to Ayala. Right now we're going to finish these lattes and then we're going to make our way to the next place. Happy to be here. Happy to be here with you. Ooh, on the town. Where are we going? We have no plan, honestly. But we're going to try and get the train now to go to Ayala Gardens. Who knows? <laughs> I think it's this way. I think it's this way. On the town. My latte is kicking in. Uh, yeah, I think we needed a boost, honestly. Rain has stopped. Thank you. Sun's goodness. out, as sun's you can out. see. Sun's out, we're out. Whew. The sun is feisty. Busy here. It's busy. Free rides. Oh, wow, oh, thank you. She just gave me two tickets. Free rides. I don't know why. Please let us know in the comments below why we just got a free ride on the MRT. First time and we get to ride for free. Things just get better and better. Made it to Ayala, so we're gonna go and check out the gardens, maybe the mall. Let's see what we can find. So we have arrived in Makati and all around me are shopping malls. Honestly, Manila is so beautiful. Every single place is different and it's just unique and interesting to see. And now that we're in Makati, this is kind of the higher end shopping malls, lots of high rise buildings. So we are at Glorietta 4, Glorietta 5. We are at SM Mall. It's literally like we're in a circle surrounded by malls. The malls here in Manila are insane. We're just really like tourists today. We're just exploring. Every single part of Manila is different and unique. And this is kind of like the higher end shopping malls. If you're coming to the Philippines, we recommend you come to Manila first, check out the city life before heading to the islands that everybody does. It's so amazing how many firsts you can have, even though we've already been here. Whoa. Look at 
that's wow so we're actually doing something super super special right now we've actually come to uniglo and we're gonna make our own seven dev merch <laughs> it wasn't planned but we actually just decided to do it so we've designed it so let's see when we print it what it looks like this is jp he's actually helped us design our shirt today thank you for your help <laughs> things that I'm still surprised by in Manila. I mean, how cool is it that we got to print our own shirts at Uniglo? But now, we're actually going in this underground walkway, which I've never seen before. So, you have to walk underground and then come out on the other side. How cool is this underground walkway? Makati is known as sort of the financial hub of Manila and you can see behind me it's known for the skyscrapers, the shopping malls. This is why we came to this part of town, just because it's so different to other areas. I mean we come from a city too, we come from Johannesburg but it's not like this and we're so lucky we just get to walk out on the streets, we get to be tourists. And it's noisy. It's noisy. It's always noisy. It's always noisy. We have just arrived at Ayala Triangle Garden and this is a perfectly triangular shaped garden right in the hub of Makati. And this is one of the places that you guys recommended. It's so tranquil, peaceful. Normally you have all the noise and now it's just completely quiet and you can just hear sounds of nature right in the hub of Manila. Everybody's sitting on the benches, there's beautiful trees, so much space to walk around. One of the best places I've seen here in Makati. This is pretty much what Chev does. Every time we go somewhere, we just hang out with the wildlife. This is Chev for scale, just how big the park and the trees are. There's cats everywhere. <laughs> Look over there. Oh. Chev is so happy right now. Hello, Makati cat. Why is your tongue out? Uh. <laughs> you good? I think this is now one of my favorite places here in Makati. There's cats. There's so many cats. Hey guys, did you make a friend? We're sitting together. <laughs> Hopefully we'll find something to eat. It's been a long, hot day today. It's been extremely busy and jam-packed. So it's actually peak hour traffic right now. It's about 5 p.m and everybody is lining up to go and take the metro but there's no chaos it's completely organized everybody is standing in a line being totally courteous to each other and there's no pushing and shoving it really shows the respect that people have for each other totally oh my goodness <laughs> we've just come to ayala malls and this mall is massive look how many people there are when they say that the malls in the Philippines are insane, I think it's true because they literally go on and on and on. You could honestly get lost. We ordered some chicken teriyaki balls. I got mine with some pineapple. It looks so good. And after a long day of walking around Manila, I think this is gonna be perfect. Oh my gosh, let's have a little bite. I got the beef one. This is so good. This is so damn good. What a day we have had. It's been unreal. I mean, I can't tell you how impressed I am with just touring Makati today. Everything that I saw, I was like, whoa, this is amazing. And even this mall is one of the craziest malls I've ever, ever seen. Everything in this area is modern, clean, mm. looked after, and it's just impressed us today. Thank you so much for watching us just walk around and explore the city today. In the next upcoming videos, we're gonna be doing some exciting things specifically here in Manila. So make sure you subscribe for that. All of you have been supporting us, cheering us on and saying road to 100K in all of our videos. So thank you for being with us on this journey. Thank you, thank you so much.